Hi everybody, Robert Dyer and welcome, welcome to the Robert Dyer Channel Christmas Countdown where tonight I have another new product and this is from Pop-Tarts. These are the frosted A&W root beer Pop-Tarts. Now this is definitely one of the more unusual flavors I've found. They also had Orange Crush, but I got the A&W root beer. It says since 1919. And it's strange that they have these down in Virginia, but not up where I am, uh, which is closer to Pennsylvania Dutch root beer territory. But uh, you can see it says new flavor up here. And there's eight in the box. One of these is 200 calories, 8% fat for the day. 0% cholesterol, 170 milligrams of sodium, 3% fiber for the day, 12% carbohydrates, 15 grams of sugar, which I guess is not too bad. So let's get this open here. I'm going to heat it up in the microwave. So we'll come back in one second while I do that. So here it is out of the microwave. It says to put it on three seconds. It doesn't taste, uh, it doesn't feel very warm to me. The aroma. It's interesting that since I put it in the microwave, I can smell a root beer aroma. It's like you got your nose over a mug of root beer. Let's go ahead and see how it tastes. Well, I'm getting a little bit of a root beer flavor. It sort of comes off as a paste, obviously. I would say it's a pretty accurate flavor, not only to root beer, but specifically to the A&W recipe. Well, I thought this was pretty good. If you like root beer, I think you'll like this flavor very accurate flavor even though it's quite a different substance from a uh, carbonated liquid. I'm pleased that they put some frosting on here which could not only represent that head of foam that you get on a root beer but also please keep away from me any pop tart that doesn't have frosting on it. Oh god. It's like eating a piece of cardboard without it. I think I'm more of a toaster strudel person than a pop tart, but a, uh, there's no denying that these are much easier to get to in a hurry if you don't have a toaster handy or the time to heat it up. So I would say this would be pretty good for breakfast or dessert. I'm going to go ahead and give this four stars. Hope you like this video. Share it with your friends. Please subscribe and I'll see you tomorrow on this Christmas countdown. Bye everybody.